What's up, guys? It's Luke Exotic. I mean, Mike Exotic for you guys. This is uh, your senior tribute video. And uh, I made one a while ago, but I cried, so I thought I should start over. This will be better. Um, last couple days, Hillcrest, we've had our seniors graduate, come in and do their thing, walk across the stage, social distance, and it's pretty awkward, but anyway, you guys, you guys finally made it. Some of y'all been with me for one year and two years. Some of y'all, I've even had three years in school, and um, I know I've gone, grown really close to some of y'all, and you know, we've talked a lot and we spent a lot of time together and went on trips together and went camping and, you know, spent time in class and talked and joked and had fun. And um, I was listening to this uh, Lumineer song called Nobody Knows. And it goes, uh, nobody knows how to say goodbye. Um, it seems so easy until you try. And I was out, out front, um, telling some of my graduates goodbye today, and um, kind of talked and what are you doing next year and all that. And you know, we kind of just stood there. And it's it's hard to say goodbye when you you hadn't seen each other for so long and you know, you've been out of school and. It, it just doesn't seem like it's like you should be saying goodbye. Um, but when we come to this point, you know, it's time for you guys to move on and for you to, you know, you're adults now and you're growing up and you're going to college and school and whatever you're getting to work and whatever you're getting into. And, you know, it's time for you to move on. You know, it sucks that all this happened and, you didn't get prom and graduation like you normally would have and didn't get to spend those last few weeks together. But, you know, sometimes you just persevere and you move on and do the best you can and that's all we can do right now. And, um, I hope and pray that you guys, you know, where you move on to and what you what you do next, you, you follow your heart and you find something that you love and that you want to do and that you, you know, pour yourself into and, you know, that you can feel like you're doing something significant. Um, I, I, I love teaching. And the thing I love the most about teaching is um, I get to come to school and I get to hang out with you guys and talk and have fun. And I feel like, you know, I get to do something significant in somebody else's life. I'm not getting paid a lot. I'm not getting, you know, big accolades, but, you know, I get to do something that, that makes a difference. And I hope all you guys, as you go out there, you know, you realize how you're trying to train, figure out how you're going to spend the rest of your life, what you're going to be doing. And, you know, I hope you figure out, you know, what it is your heart wants to do and how you can do something special. I think you all got you know, you're all great and you're all awesome and you're you're smart and you're funny and you're talented and you got character and um I'd be disappointed if you didn't do something great. Um you know. I'm sad we didn't get to hug it out one last time. I'm sad we didn't get to say our goodbyes and have a you know, a end of school party and maybe one last field trip to the sewage treatment plant that we planned, but you know, sometimes life doesn't work out like you want it to. And, uh, but that's okay. You know, y'all got a big life ahead of you. I'm turning 40 this year. And, uh, it seems like yesterday I was walking across that stage at Winston County High School. And the older you get, the faster it goes. And, you know, all I can say is, you know, make it count. Make every minute count. Make every day count. Um, because it'll be gone quick. 
and you'll wish you had it back and wish you could have done something better. So don't have any regrets. Always push yourself. Always enjoy life, love, and have fun. Take time to care about others. Do stuff for other people. Those are the important things. And if you do those, you'll have a good life. And, uh, you know, I miss you guys. Hope y'all come back to see me. Uh -huh. I just want you to know I love you and I care about you. And, you know, at least one day when you're as old as me or maybe a little bit older, you'll tell your kids and your grandkids when they start whining about their senior year and wanting to get out of school early. and You'll be like, you don't even know what it's like. I remember back in 2020. Let me tell you a story. And so, um, you got that. You got that for sure. I miss you guys. I wish you guys the best. And uh, you guys take care.